<coughs> hey guys, what's up? This is CAD A99. Uh, sorry about the beginning of black, uh, just showing you. Uh, also, how this kind of cool. Uh, should be seeing my screen. And then my CAD, which is probably up here. Uh, it's a little banner I did on my own uh, with uh, paint. Uh, so, uh, Anyway, I'm kind of showing you guys a couple of how to use the basics of OBS. Uh, if you want to do a look down here, it seems. Uh, I'll make this a little bigger for you guys. I don't know. Okay. Uh, and here you got seams. Uh, I got my color before. I just desktop. Desktop. All I do is. Uh, that one, but uh, this is what it'll probably look like. But because I'm, I don't know why. Uh, anyways, uh, I see, yes, seen. I don't have nothing in sources, right? So, uh, it's black, and then you got these. It's really nothing too much different on these two at the time, other than uh. My placement of that is slightly off on one compared to the other, right? So, anyways, this is basics on how to record. Uh, sorry I'm not good at this. I tend to talk a lot. I'm just showing you my setup. Uh, uh, like I said, you get a banner, kind of cool. Uh, that's my image. So what you want to do, you start this thing up. It'll be scene, which will have nothing. <coughs> so you want to right click scene. You see, hit add scene, and then you name it what you want. Uh, so, desktop, I like to just do my regular uh, scene monitor capture. Call it before, I usually don't have monitor capture, so it's just game image. Uh, the way you do is once you get yours, like here, uh, you name it, like I'll probably do Counter Strike, different games. Then come over here, now if you want a game. Make sure you open the game first. Uh, normally, in this screen, what you've seen, is on my other uh, monitor. So I can slide it off the monitor. And uh, <coughs> so I can see all this on my other monitor. So I can kind of see myself. I don't know if my mic's on or not. Uh, this is uh, your in game sound, if you're in game, or your desktop. So I love. Uh, so. And then I, you know, that's off and on. Uh, I have the hot key. I like that way I just mute it and push the talk. But, uh, so what you want to do, you want to get like game, make sure you open up the game and then get out of it. And then alt. Once it's here, see this one, uh, do you do settings on it? I don't know, so. See right here is for my call it's already set now. So but if I add a new one, this this game, it won't pick it up because I don't have it open. The only base and most of these I don't even have open. I don't know why there's a few, but I don't know what's all. So you have to have that game open first. Now the first time you do it then it, it shows up. So you got the game open. Image figure out how to do it. I, I can do an editorial later or social and if you just want a simple banner come on we can get on um, getting all the other stuff I, everything I've, I'm using is free you click this browse so I got my two I had one like this first that's a little bit longer on the sides so I kind of shut it uh, shorten it up a little uh, and then you basically have it posted and bring it on and then uh, and then monitor capture you just want to do monitor, so you know, another one. But you basically want your monitor, so you can set it up, and then this basically captures whatever is shown on your uh, monitor, and it shows whatever's up top. So if you don't have game capture, or if it doesn't work, you just try monitor capture, and it'll show whatever plays on the monitor first. So if I bring up a game, it'll show that because it's whatever's on top of the monitor. Uh, 
shit, that's not mine. Let's so bring that over. Now it's blocking everything. Alright, if I make that big, you should, you've probably seen this instead of uh, this, right? So, that's what the Margo one does. Uh, I think Windows one or something, that I think you could pick text is kind of cool. Uh, if you don't, if you just want your name up top. Uh, you can pick a font, size, the color for instance, and then you can write a text. And let's say I just want to do a uh, CAD. Okay. And now if you look up here, it's right there. And then I'll use edit scene. You do that and then you pick which scene you want. You want the text. You can move that around. See? So you can see it. Uh, if I want to move my uh, image to make be a little bit more. Right then you do that. Uh, so, and you could also, I want to make it bigger, smaller. And then you can click, remove if you want it. Uh, so, if that's something you can set up. And I think I made mine like my favorite color is orange. I kind of moved a little bit, but uh, it's more like this color for my name at one time, but I like how the border and the blacks of that in-game stuff, it just makes it easy for people to see. So if, if, but hey, you can, if you just want something small, you can actually do a text like that. Alright, uh, anyways, so that's how you, like I said, you either want game capture, AC or monitor capture, and then when you play a game on whatever the main monitor, it, it'll show up on that. Uh, I like to bring, like I said, this over, you can preview, preview your stream or anything that'll show oops, everything like this uh, but without recording uh, I got this recording right now for this video but that's prior to recording to kind of see how things look so uh, but like I said I like to take this and go over that way you can kind of see uh, so my twitch I like to have it on my other screen and I can see when people chat I need to get an overlay on this <coughs> but um, now you can hit. Anyway, so we're going to do settings now what I have. And a couple things I changed to make it lower. Uh, either you click this once, or come up here, click, and then click settings. Uh, so I like that one because it's one time. So my general, here's what I have English. Yeah, I'm in the United States. Uh, not a perk at this, but uh, here's things I did. Uh, well, pick your one. Uh, I was messing with the game just to see what they do on the thing. Not 100%. I think this one's more of a CPU, and I think this one's more using GPU. I'm not sure. But uh, I don't have that clicked. I saw something not to, so I didn't. Uh, quality, I just picked 8. Uh, I had everything 10. I had this way up like 1500 or whatever. And that missed clicked. Bitrate 160 for my uh, audio. I lower this and that's I think the same. Uh, I guess it helps your uh, video. So it's a different size. Uh, I, just, I mean, I know for streaming this is ideal, ideal as well, so I just picked that. Uh, my upload is like. 10 megs or something, so pretty good. Uh, I have a download of like over 100 megs, but so I just picked a 3500 broadcast. Oh, if you make any changes, yeah, because I did that. Always want to hit apply, but I did it, so I was still going to apply it. Right now, file output only allows you just to record. Uh, pick a file. I've, I've, even shutter play whenever I use an external hard drive I don't know why it doesn't work so I always have to I just pick my seat I don't know what the issue is sometimes it, the videos work sometimes it doesn't uh, at the time I had this says mp4 but I changed it back to the, the YouTube or default here I just have messed up with this one I what saves I put mp4 um, I'm not sure if this one is anyway so uh, replay buffer, I put it 15 seconds, just, uh, and then it's a, what is that, uh, kind of like a loop, so when you, you can save your replay, 
So if you're gaming and you make an awesome shot, you can hit save and it'll save it because it's 15 seconds behind. Uh, so it's kind of cool. Um, Shadow play does a minute is the lowest. So I kind of like this. Another thing I like is when I get, uh, I think it's advanced. Or sorry, uh, hockey's. Get look here is you, I, I set my start stream. Well, for stream F9. Uh, but F1, pretty much start, record, stop, record. I have the same. I would just say button. See replay buffer. Uh, it just turns it off for you. You don't always have to have it. I uh, remember though, if it's on, it's almost like recording, so it may or may not make you take a hit. Uh, so, but here's what I like: you can either save just the replay buffer, so that last 15 seconds you can save, or you could uh, continue recording. You know, like up here, record will start the time you hit record. Here, if you record, will start. But 15 seconds prior, so we'll start with where you're with the buffer. I like that. My shadow doesn't do it, so my fraps did. I like fraps a little bit. Fraps takes a huge hit on your PC when you're recording. So, anyways, this is nice that you know, if you're starting to get a nice streak going, you know, maybe you set your buffer for two minutes or something and you can continue, right? So, anyways, back up here. Uh, so, I got this. You can go to live stream, be a Twitch. You want to make sure you pick the closest place to you. Uh, I got Twitch. Get your key. Uh, there's a video on how to get that if you don't know. You connect. All right. Uh, so same. Down here, it kind of tells you some settings. You can pick optimize if you want, but. Uh, I haven't really done Twitch yet, so I'll just go to the next one. I don't want to save. There's my video. Here's what my no more resolution is. I use the down scale. So I do that 720. That's kind of the default. Now it works. I'm sure you might my hotkeys up here. I don't really like push to talk. I just, I'd rather mute or I mute my mic. This is for the, uh, like you said, desktop or uh, in game. In advanced. Here, uh, so multi thread. You usually want at least above normal or high. That will give you priority. See my friend, but so not here. Super good. Uh, here. If I like them, I don't like my videos too big. File size. I don't care right now for quality. To read it uh, lower is a uh, better quality, but Salsa is this or uses more of a CPU when you're doing it. Here, I just use main. I don't know what the difference with main or high. Zero on that. I don't have all these, so that's my setting. Fast, less CPU usage. So. But yeah, uh, about it, what I have. Uh, so, I like these settings that I'm using right now. Uh, they're pretty good. Uh, I do have a video in my channel you can look up. Uh, not always the best quality, but uh, make sure I share something. But uh, it's a. Uh, but uh, it's the last one I did. I should have the smaller one of this. Uh, you see the quality. Um, yeah, I got the minutes on that one. This one's already up there, but uh, I have 30, 37 minutes for it. Oh, I think I just deleted it out on here. I usually, once I upload a video, I delete it. Uh, so, yeah, I also said my OBS. Yeah. This is what I'm doing now, so yep, I can leave it. My, but uh, it was 37 minutes long, and it was only about 758 megabits. Uh, so really small. I mean, for 34 minutes, and it looks pretty good. Uh, and then I use one of those movie maker 
and I uh, configured it from YouTube, which actually made it higher. It went to uh, 1.3 gigs. I think that's because I, if you saw, I, uh, yeah, while I'm doing that, uh, I do 720 right here. Uh, I could go higher, but this keeps it low. Uh, I think when I convert it, with Windows Movie Maker to YouTube, it must be. I think I have my YouTube for 1080, so it's probably so it's probably doing that. Uh, so I don't know. I need to switch. Let's see. Use this. Uh, I don't know why. Oh, I guess I want the blue. Do I have a video? I don't know if I have a video now. Uh, that sucks. They have to leave them all. But uh, I'll have to look at it later when I'm done with this. But uh, yeah, in here, I think I have it. Uh, I wish you would let you fix things but uh yes yeah, so I think I like to have to look at the settings on it but I think it's going to 1080 so I probably just need to keep it 720 so it just keeps the heat I might even be able when these are free enough to straight up upload them but I think I'm downloading an mp4 so I don't know YouTube is a FLV or something uh, so I might have to you know if you go in here change this to the FLV as well and then maybe I'll go might even be short and directly to uh, YouTube but this I think gives a better quality I'm not sure uh, so I think default is FLV anyway so I might have to try that as well but uh anyway sorry if this was long um learning it needs to be uh I just started using it uh OBS is again free so I went with it uh I was using Shadow Play. I have a 900, 965 graphics card, so Shadow Play works really well. Uh, but someone said, hey, try this. Um, it's not as user friendly until you get going, and then it's kind of easy. Uh, Shadow Play was a little bit easier. Uh, however, on this, I do like that I could move these around. Uh, another thing is, all these you can, different things you can make video capture uh, webcam uh, so you can actually do a webcam on this as well and then you can place that someplace and that will show up on top so all these different things will show up on top of the game or video so like you guys see this cat head right here but on my actual screen up here it's not there it's just with the recorder so yeah anyways uh, if anyone who's interested to uh, do this I mean it was a whole simple with paint shop I could try to do another video on that uh, or how about uh, my next goal is to maybe try to do a banner that might come around and then have a middle I don't know I'm sure you could do that with paint shop have like a circle or whatever but have the middle part blanked out so uh, so but paint shop is free so and uh, OBS is free so I'm trying to use things that are free and keeps me my money. Uh, so, yeah, anyways, uh, thanks for watching. Uh, um, this helps somebody. Uh, everything I saw, sorry, uh, is if sometimes it's a black in game, either A, don't use game capture, try to monitor capture, or B, just try game capture, and then I guess you some games you have to enable the anti cheat compatibility rookie. So, I guess for some people that works on certain games. So, that's something to try if you're getting a black screen. Either monitor 
or that. So, monitor, like I said, is your whatever's on top. Uh, all right, thanks, guys. Bye.